like Rosa Rafter, and today I'm going to be taking a Cuphead test. The test is, which Cuphead boss are you? I'm actually scared to figure this out. <laughs> I don't want to be one of the big evil ones. I, personally, myself, I think I would be Grim Matchstick, because, like, I'm nervous, like, in real life. Like, I, see, when I'm recording, I put on a show for all y'all. Like, I act like I don't really care, but uh, on the inside, I really care, and... <laughs> Oh, some things I really don't care. That's what makes it hard, is sometimes I actually do care and sometimes I don't. Anyways, um, this is a video test, so the link is going to be in the description so you can take it yourself. Because, yeah. And let's just go. If I get someone like King Dice, I'm going to be like, wow, how? Because <laughs> King Dice counts. So does the devil. Any cuphead boss. I have food with me, I'm sorry. Okay, ten questions. How about ten seconds to answer each one? I'm gonna have to keep my controller on then, because I have to read this to you guys, because you guys can't see. How would you prefer to be? A. Sly. B. Terrifying. C. Crazy. D. Evil. E. Ugly. Or F. Arrogant. Ain't nobody trying to be arrogant. <laughs> uh, personally, myself, I would want to be sly because I ain't sly. I would, I would want to be sly. To be honest. And I'm answering this all honestly. So if I wasn't, then it wouldn't be accurate. Okay, add 20. Number two. Which word relates to you the most? A star, C hearts, E laser, B black, D fish, F flames. Also with me, it would have to be black, because that's my favorite color. Black. Okay, my favorite colors are a cyan blue, black, and pink, which is obvious. No, just kidding, I hate pink. It was B for black. A forty. Okay, question three. What feature would you rather? Okay, I'm gonna stop eating my fries because, like, it's probably an ASMR. <laughs> okay. Anyways, what feature would you rather have? A power, B strength, C speed, D luck, E beauty, or F intelligence? Mm, I'm torn between speed and luck, because I'm not fast at all. That's Sonic's job. <laughs> I have to say luck, because I'm not really that lucky. I want to be like Kamida. I want Kamida to bless me with his luck. <laughs> not his uh, not his lucky stuff, but his luck. But then again, every lucky thing that happens to him ends up um, be turning into bad luck. Anyways, alright, at 30. I'm honestly scared. <laughs> I'm scared of who I really am on the inside, whose personality I have from Cuphead on the inside. Okay, which creature would you rather be? A, an alien. B, Hydra. I don't even know what that is. C, ghost. D, vampire. E, werewolf. Or F, a zombie. Out of all of these, because of course there's different creatures and stuff, but out of these choices, I would have to say a vampire. I already drink blood sometimes, so... Don't, don't worry, it's my own. Totally just my own. Okay, 30. That's a lot of... We have like two 30s. What is your biggest flaw? A, guilt. B, superiority. C, greed. D, na naivety. E, intolerance. Or F, hate. Guilt. It has to be guilt. It's guilt. This is revealing a lot about me. <laughs> but it would have to be guilt. I'm a very reflective person. This is really making me confront myself. Another 30, Jesus. C. I mean, 6. <laughs> I said C. 
Which job slash profession do you find most the most interesting? A fighter, B dealer, C scientist, D pilot, E gangster, or F admirable. Uh, admirable. We all know I ain't gonna be no gangster. Everybody know I ain't gonna walk up into the hood and be like, Ugh, man. <laughs> I ain't no fighter. I try to be, but I ain't. Scientist. I'm interested in science, but not enough to want to be a scientist and a pilot. No. So, out of these, it would have to be a dealer. Oh, God. I'm just confronting myself. And I'm scared of myself. So, a dealer. Another 30. Jesus. Seven. Which type of horror movie would you prefer to watch? A type of horror movie? Okay, A, comedy, B, cannibal, C, monster, D, psychological, E, action, or F, supernatural. Honestly, comedy. Because I, I, like, sometimes I like being scared, but most of the time I like laughing, so, uh, comedy. So, A. Gotta wait for the ten seconds. Three, two, one. I swear to God, if it's another thirty. Okay, it's a twenty. It's about to say if it's another thirty. I swear. Eight. How are you when it comes to emotions? Um. A hidden. I don't want to feel embarrassed. B careful. I think before I speak. C strong. I'm a rock with no emotions. That. That's not me. Sadly, I wish it was. D, playful. It doesn't matter what happens. E, confident. I know what I want. F, like an open book. Drama just isn't my concern. I have to be honest. And my honesty is A. My all honesty. I realize how sad I am. <laughs> I am realizing how sad I am. How pitiful I am. Ten. Okay, number nine. We're getting close to the end. Don't worry. Pick a quote. A. One, two, three, you better flee. B. So clever, so dapper. hi yo. C. Holy mackerel, is that your best effort? D. Anyone who opposes me will be destroyed. E. Objective completed. Target scrapped. F. You lost too soon and I was only half a moon. You guys know those are the boss's quotes when you die, right? And honestly, mine would have to be one, two, three, you better flee. If, like, if I was a fighter, of course. If I wasn't, I would probably be, like, weepy, but that isn't an option. Like, I'd be like, it's okay if you have to cry. But that's not an option, so. One, two, three, you better flee. Okay, 50. We're at 260. Last question. Which boss is your favorite? A. The Devil, slash Beppy the Clown, slash Phantom Express. B. Calamaria, Baroness Obama, Sally Stage Play. C. Grim Matchstick, Goopy Legrand, Ruby and Croaks, Cagney Carnation. D. Hildeberg, Rumor Honeybottoms, The Root Pack. E. King Dice, Werner Worman, Wally Warbles. F. Dr. Cow's Robot, De Jimmy the Great, Great I put great with Captain. Captain Brightybeard. I have to say E. Because, like, that's the only one with King Dice in it. And King Dice is actually my favorite Cuphead character. I mean, like, I, I if you want me to, I could go into a whole video of why King Dice is my favorite. But, um, I'm not a fangirl or anything. He's just my favorite out of the game of bosses. So, E. But, honestly, I, I think I'm more like Grim Matchstick, if you think about it. Oh, there's the timer, finally. Jesus. <laughs> Thought it was only supposed to take ten seconds. Okay, thirty. Alright, so we have two hundred and ninety. For the results, you can pick your- Okay, so basically this is if you're on a phone, but I'm on an Xbox. Okay, but I'm gonna press the pause button anyway to see if I- what I get in the roulette. 
Okay, so with the roulette, uh, I'm gonna try the roulette one more time. Okay, with the roulette, I got Blind Spectre from the Phantom Express. Now let's see who I really get from the points. Results. Okay, so if you got 100 to 170 points, then you're Hildeberg. She's boss in Equal Isle 1 in the Threatening Zeppelin level. Hildeberg is a human Zeppelin hybrid that creates tornadoes, transforms into three constellations, or a huge crescent moon. No, she does turn it into a huge crescent mood in her final phase, you idiot. Have you played Cuphead? Because <laughs> I sure have. Okay, so if you got 180 points to 260, so I got close to getting Kala. Kala Maria. <laughs> She's a mermaid boss that appears in Equal Isle 3 in the level, I mean, in the high C, high jinx level. Well, it said a level anyway. Kella has a wide range of attacks and can summon ghost pirates by spewing them from her mouth, which is actually kind of freaky if you think about it. That means there's ghosts living inside her. I got King Dice. 270 to 350. I have 290. I got King Dice by, like, a few points. King Dice. Wait, wait, hold up, hold up. I'm gonna say their names in their voice, so get ready for Quinn. King Dice. He's a dice-headed man who appears in... The all bets are off level. It's boss <laughs> fight, you idiot. But also serves as a gatekeeper between overworlds. In order to battle King, at least three mini bosses must be defeated. Unless you hit the dice and you have to start over. <laughs> Trust me, I've done that millions of times and I got so mad. But I'm still going to keep reading just in case like you guys just don't feel like clicking off of this. And you just picked answer- oh, wait, never mind. Because I didn't tell you all the points. 360 to 440 points. The devil. Wait. The devil. He's the final boss, the ruler of Inkwell Hell, aka Hell itself, and the main antagonist of Cuphead. The devil transforms into a spider, ram, or dragon, and can't create attacks- oh, and can create attacks with crystal and fireballs, aka bubbles. Seriously, I can't be the only one that thinks the crystals look like bubbles. 450 to four, uh, 520. Grim Okay, that's not my Grim Matchstick voice. Grim Matchstick. He appears in Equal Isle 2 in a scene in the Fiery Frolic boss fight. I'm not even going to say level because that's not what it is. It's a boss fight. Grim shoots fireballs, ripples from his eyes, smoke or fire from his nose. And also uses his tail to attack. See, it's not smoke or fire. He does both. Excuse me, have you played Cuphead? I don't think the creator of this played Cuphead. I think they just went to Wikipedia. Because Wikipedia is never 100% right. 530 points to 600 points. Dr. Cow's robot. This boss is a combination of a robot and a crazy scientist. And appears in Equal Isle 3. In the Junkyard Jive boss fight. Cole can attack with lasers, nuts, bolts, bombs, and gems. A.K.A. the Chaos Emeralds. <laughs> I can't be the only one that thought those were the Chaos Emeralds. <laughs> okay. So. It's over here like, if you think your score isn't right, you can calculate like this. More 10 points answers equal Hilda, 20 points equal Kala, 40 points equal Devil, more 60 point answers Call, 50 points Grim, 30 King, and yeah. So I got King Dice. Apparently I'm a, uh, apparently I'm an asshole who gets little kids to gamble their souls. Oh wait, no, that was the devil that did that. Well, apparently I'm the devil's good for nothing lackey. Wow. That sucks. Guess I better grab a purple bow tie. <laughs> yeah, I guess I better go grab a purple bow tie. Bye, guys. I'm no longer Rosie the Rascal. I am now King Dice, apparently.